Hi, I'm Luther Tan. Today I'm going to teach you how to build the custom indicator through the EA Builder. This is the overview of the overall tutorial. So you will learn the introduction of the free EA Builder, which EA Builder is free to build your custom indicator. And I will briefly describe what is supported in this EA Builder in order to build the criteria. And last, I will show you how to build this custom indicator through the EA Builder. So I'm going to recommend you to use this eabuilder.com. This site provides free access and the building of the custom indicator through the EA Builder. So this is the web-based EA Builder where you will need to click through the interfaces and then build your own criteria. And the most importantly, this is a free access. So what you need to do is just sign up for free and you're able to download the full functionality for the indicators. So after you sign up, this is a user interface where you can click through an add condition and um, build your indicators. So in overall, I will rate these four stars out of five stars. Con consider that I'm the new in the EA building. And um, the reason is, it's very quick, easy, easy to learn, and easy to build the criteria. So the interaction is as smooth as um, the other web EA builder. And the good side is the page did not, did not keep on refreshing when you, you add on the new site because it is using the JavaScript, which is a fast refraction and um, fast refresh rate. All right? So overall, it is quite intuitive to be used. In terms of the criteria supports or the strategy that is support for custom indicators, I will rate this 4 stars out of 5 stars. It is because of this is quite compact, uh, complete. The condition that support is very complete. So as in a full list of the indicators of the or the condition that you can use. So in fact, this is the most complete condition that I've come across throughout different kind of EA builder. So that's why that I rate this four out of five stars. However, um, for this EA builder, this is suitable for those beginners who want to build a simple EA a simple custom indicators. Alright. So uh, this is not suitable for the user who want to create very complex custom indicator like even though it's such, such like, like private point that you need to do massive of a calculation and a massive of a condition check. So this is not for those uh, complex indicator, but this is just only for suitable for simple indicators. So the supported condition are quite comprehensive. So start from the indicators that you are able to see in the MT4, like for example, uh, accelerator oscillators, accumulation or distribution, and etc. So the whole list right here, you can find the indicators that you want to build your own custom indicators. It also supports the price, whether it's us a bit, the candlestick price from all the time frame from one minute to one month, or the current time frame, the chart time frame, the number of the candlesticks that uh, you can refer to, and the last that you can use is uh, the last previous 20 bar. And you also even can uh, compare on the open price, high price, low price, close price, and even the body length. 
and you can use this custom code however in order to write this you need to know the basic or the MQL4 programming knowledge in order to use this custom code you can write your own custom code and these two are new where this eabuilder.com they are supported to compare the custom indicator through trend line whether it's uptrend or downtrend and they have their own calculation of this support and resistance line this is all free to be used and the rest of the extra features such as you can draw it in a separate window right so there is uh, for the indicators you can see like RSI for the all the MACD is shown in a separate window so this EA Builder supported this one this feature and there are a lot of the additional features such as, such as um, show up an alert when the indicator is pain or print out to the journal, send to email, print to file, send notification right so let me bring you through and have a look have a site tour on what is this eabuilder.com looks like so after you have registered you will be bring to this interface so you log in into this eabuilder.com then you are able to see this site and then on the top right top left so this is a place where you can choose whether EA or strategy by default oh sorry indicator or strategy so by default this is an indicators and uh, the first step is showing the indicators condition and you can click on this one and uh, this is a list of the criteria that you can choose and make comparison with as you can see this is a list of the these of the uh, indicators that you have known price list bid price and ask price uh, candlesticks to compare with which time frame and which bar current bar and the previous bar support only up to 20 bar previous this one candles, candlestick value and even you, you can write your own code right here right so you can compare against same things indicator price candlestick trend line uptrend lower trend support and resistance value and also the fixed value all right okay so another tab this is just to show in um, the additional feature such as you can draw the indicator in the chart window you can draw the indicator in a separate window yeah then you even can show up different kind of alert like the audible alert send print to journal send to email print to file send a notification yeah the input value and this is the source that is generated from your criteria or the option that have you selected in previous tab all right next so just before you want to build the custom indicators there are a few more tips I want to teach you on how to build your indicators first is you should know that when you need the indicator to be drawn so on the other word it means that your condition you need to know your condition and what condition is met in order to draw the indicators again indicator is just like a value or a condition where the line should be drawn or the object like the arrow down arrow down arrow up arrow down to be drawn so the first step is when the indicator should be drawn like for example 
Um, I will set the current bar. I will check on the current bar at the time, maybe uh, 10 o'clock, whether the ask price is larger than the 5 moving average. So if this condition is met or is true, then I want to draw the indicators. All right. So another one. So after you know when you should draw your indicators, then you should know where the indicator should be drawn. Okay, so second tip is you should know where the indicator should be drawn. So right here, for example, I want to draw. So once the condition is met, I want to draw the condition, let's say on the bar, maybe the bar at the ask price or the bid price. Okay, this is just an example. Okay, now I want to show you how to build the custom indicator. The example is for the step one, I identify my condition where I draw I want to draw the indicator when my five moving average is uh, more than 13 moving average. This is my first condition. And my second one is where I want to draw that is I want to draw on the candlestick low means at the low 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 price and I want to draw a line okay so you can draw a line or as an object or you can draw uh, maybe an arrow as an object okay so let's look into how we could build this our custom indicators and put it in our MT4 Okay, so this is my EA Builder. Click on the condition. So I choose my, and now I'm building my condition to this pop-up dialog. So I'm checking on maybe, okay, moving average, current time frame, with five, and uh, this is all the moving average parameter that you should set. And okay, this is a criteria, so I want the price where the 5 moving average is moved above, let's say, another one, I will set my next condition to 13, and time frame is a current, and that's all. So once you have completed your criteria setting, just click OK. So this will, book, this will be uh, generated, a set of this UI, the interface will be generated on the based on the condition that you have selected. All right. Next, I want once this condition is met, I want this to be a line. Yeah, a solid line. Maybe a width. I set it thicker width. Label by this is okay. And I want to set it to okay. I leave it as it is current one and I show it as a low click OK now I have done complete to my setting my condition and also I know where I should draw my indicators next I just move to the last tab source then they will generate the indicator list the indicator source file for me so what you need to do is just copy or download for me, I will download and then this is where I download in my download file. Now I need to copy it to my MT4 indicator folder. So I open my MT4. This is a meta editor. Let me open this one. Okay, I need to put the indicator that I have created inside this folder. Again, where to find this folder, please refer to my previous video. I'll show you where to put this, where which folder that you should put in the indicator in case that you don't know. So I just copy this one and then I go to my drive, program file. MetaTrader 4 under indicators. So I will put this under indicators 
and paste it so I just paste it and uh, yep this is my indicator name indicator 01 alright so at this point so you can see that the indicator 01 is not here yeah it's not here so what I need to do is just only refresh and then find out yep there you go and double click so make sure that uh, this indicator is selected and I compile make sure that is no error and compile successful now move to my MT4 and drag down the indicators and then find out the indicator 01 similar to what you need to do with the normal indicators is MT4 just drag it or the double click and there you go so you can see that my custom indicator is shown right here so this is the line that I'm drawing so at the bottom line of uh, each of the price okay so this is this show that how I will build I build my own custom indicator in just a few seconds through the EA builder all right so in this tutorial you should learn what free EA to be EA builder to be used to build your custom indicators and what it is supported what criteria it is supported and how you use this EA builder to build your custom indicators okay so thank you for watching and happy learning for more free video tutorials please visit to mt4programmingcourse.com if you find this video helps you give me a like and subscribe my youtube channel again thank you for watching and happy learning